Welcome to English with Teacher. I'm Teacher. Thank you very much for joining me today. I hope you're having a great day. Um, to everyone who's like who likes, shares my videos and has subscribed to the channel, thank you very much. I appreciate it. You're helping to promote the channel, build the channel, and um, showing me your appreciation. So thank you. For all those who don't, I would ask that you please do. And also, if you hit the little bell icon below, um, it will let you know when I come out with new videos. Also, if you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section. I really want to chat with you guys and, you know, uh, communicate with you more. So today, we'll be working on practical English um, with a series of questions. I will be asking my wonderful co-host and uh, we will work on her grammar and pronunciation. So please ma'am, introduce yourself. Uh, Harry, uh, hello teacher, hello everyone. I'm Anna from <coughs> Vietnam. Thank you very much. So let's start out with some questions. Uh, do you have a camera? Um, no, I don't. I don't have a camera. I use a camera um, on my phone. Okay. And do you like to take pictures? Uh, yes, of course. <laughs> yes, I do. I like to take pictures. Nice. Um, <clears throat> Uh, what do you like to take pictures of? Mm, I, like, I like to take pictures of um, nature, nature view. And, um, nature? So usually nature, you just say nature? Nature, nature view. Usually you don't say view. Usually you just say oh. take pictures of nature. Okay. Right? Because like the, the pictures are your view. Okay. I like to take pictures of nature. Nice. Anything in particular? Some people like birds. Some people like butterflies. Some people take plants. Mm, yeah. Um, about plants. And um, uh, yeah, uh, flowers. Flowers. Okay, when you when you say it, say plants. Plant. Plants. Yeah, plant. Nice. Okay, you have to get that little t in there. It doesn't have to be loud, but it has to be there for the T. Okay, um, do you like to take pictures of people at things like weddings and stuff like that? Um, yes, I do. I like to take pictures of the people uh, yeah, at a wedding or party or um, traveling, when I traveling like that. Nice, nice. Um, do you know anyone who's a professional photographer? Yes, um, a lot of people allow me to. It's very good at um, taking pictures. Okay, so a lot of people around uh, me. Yeah, a lot of people around me are very good. At taking pictures, a very good of taking pictures. Nice. And do they make money from it? Um, no, no, not really. I they um <laughs> they they like just a, a person. <laughs> like, uh, yeah. Okay. Like um, would like to have a lot of pictures of themselves or the yeah, people. selfies. Yeah. Um. <laughs> Uh, what was I going to say? So when they say a professional photographer, right? 
A professional isn't someone who's good. A professional is someone who gets paid for it. Uh, yes. Um. Okay. So there, there, there's a difference, right? So, someone like I'm an English teacher. I'm not a professional English teacher because I don't get paid for teaching English. <laughs> really? Right? Okay. So, yeah. but but that that's a big difference when you're talking to someone. I do YouTube. I'm not a professional YouTuber because I don't get paid yet. So I don't make yeah. any money. Uh, yeah. So that that so, that's an important distinction when you're talking to a lot of people. Yeah. So when you so so when somebody says you know, I play golf. Oh, professionally. No, it's just a hobby. Mm, yeah, okay. Good. Same as I do yoga professionally. No, it's just a hobby. Mm, yeah. So, so um, in a conversation, it actually makes a difference whether the word, whether the term professional is used. Mm. Okay. Um. Do you ever go to an art gallery? Mm, art gallery? Um, no, I haven't gone to an art gallery. Art gallery. Art gallery. Okay. Um, do you share photos on social media? Uh, share my photo on social media. Okay, photos. 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 Okay. Um, do you think it's okay to take pictures of random people? Like someone taking pictures of people on the street? Or do you think that's an invasion of privacy? I don't think it's okay, but because um, some people may uh, feel harder um, and uh, don't like to, um, don't like the general to use their photo. They don't, they don't want, they don't like the who? Stranger, stranger so okay. So they don't stranger. want the stranger. Yeah, they don't want the strangers to have their pictures. Their right. Photos. Some people are protecting themselves from some things, so they might not want to be seen in certain situations. Things like that. Um... Do you think a lot of people now use cell phones instead of cameras? Yes, I think so. I think a lot of people now using cell phones instead of cameras. Nice. Um, do you like to take a lot of pictures when you travel? Yes, I do. I uh, I took. A lot of pictures um, when I were when I were traveling. When when I was traveling. When, when I was traveling. Nice, nice, very good, very good. And um, do you like digital pictures or? the regular pictures better picture or regular picture digital like on your camera or a regular picture like a paper um, I like I like um, picture the regular picture yeah, rather than the regular picture. Okay, me too. 
You can alter the digital ones too much. <laughs> There's an app for that. I guarantee it. <laughs> um, do you think people should share their photographs online? Sharing the photograph online uh, for their friends is okay. Okay. I think it depends on the photograph. Yes, it depends. If I take a photograph of a beautiful tree or a bird, yeah, I can put that online. If I take a photograph of people, then I'm not going to share that online. Like when I, when I do a dinner and I want to take a picture of the food, I stand up and I take a picture of the food so no one's face is in the picture. Yeah. To protect people's identity, right? Because you never know. So, yeah, that's, that's just something I personally do. Well, thank you very much. It was very helpful. It was very nice chatting with you. So... Um, I'd like to thank everybody for watching as well. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned some stuff. And I hope you improved your English grammar a little bit. So, thank you very much. Um, I will see you in the next video. Have a great day.